A Vermillion District CEO will keep his job after a special meeting tonight. David Cheremy faced termination after an investigation into staff complaints against him. Amon Boy looks into the allegations and a close vote. The allegations against David Sheremy included pay disparities between genders as well as age related jokes. But despite those allegations, he maintained his job as CEO in a 5 4 vote. Calvin Lazen. Yes. Although the board voted to keep him in office, some were in opposition, citing sexual harassment from co workers in the workplace. Constantly made inappropriate sexual comments that made me uncomfortable. He told me, quote, that's how he is. Nothing was ever done about it. I also highly suggest an outside hire as a placement. You need someone who will clean house and run the place efficiently, not just someone who is known and happy. Other issues brought up by the board included the firing of an employee because of a medical illness. I did not terminate anybody who told me they had a serious uh, medical condition, and I, I do not remember when I asked to see anybody's x rays. You know. While others advocated for him to maintain his position. I can't imagine what a complaint against Mr. Sheremy would look like other than he's too kind, too generous. We did reach out to Sheremy for an interview. He declined, but says that he is grateful that the board decided to let him stay in his position and he will take the suggestions of the board into consideration. Three's on the street in Lafayette, Mon Boyd, KTC TV3.